Introducing another player in the free AI AR platforms space, Playground AI. Their website, accessible through the provided link, showcases a community feed of images, giving you a glimpse of the platform's capabilities and quality. And all you gotta do to get started is click here and log in with your Google account. And once you are in, you get this feat of images that you can of course explore. But we are gonna skip right past that and go up the top here to create and you can see we get this interface. So they do invite you to join the discord servers gonna x that for now. But essentially all we need to do to get started if you don't want to do absolutely anything yet is just simply go here to prompt and I can type in a prompt or something that I'd like to see when I'm ready to hit generate. And this is our first image. Now, let's start exploring some of the options here. Straight away. When we create this image, we can create variations, we can straight up download this image. It is currently 512 by 768 pixels also have these actions here. I can edit copy link. I can make this private, I can in paint. There is all of these awesome tools that you can apply to this image. So straight away, the first thing we are going to look at is we are gonna upscale this by 4. It's fairly, fairly decent, not as good as I probably like, but the resolution is actually pretty good at 2048 by 2048 pixels. But let's see if we can get something better. I'm going to bend this one and move on. You see there is also a pro plan available, but we are focusing on the free stuff today. And the cool thing is the model here used was Stable Diffusion. 1.5 I can switch to Stable Diffusion to point 0.1 and type something in here again and I hit Generate. So it's created this image using Stable Diffusion to point 0.1 which is another sort of even better sort of model. A little bit more updated. But I can also switch to Dolly too. However, it does require paid at all. So you can use Dolly too here if you are willing to pay for the pro licenses is $10 per month for 800 images. But we will come back to that later and see what's available. What's cool as I go through and create these images. I can also change my columns here to view more as I go. I'm gonna stick with stable fusion to point one and we are going to keep on playing. So I'm going to say here again and we can now play with a filter. So we are going to start improving and adding to this as we go. I'm gonna click on this filter and I can actually add something in here. So I have got these two here such as close a portrait or old timey. So it looks like we have just these two for now. I'm going to choose the close up portrait if we have close up portrait somewhere in the Merlin old and wise powerful wizard and we can also remove certain things from the image. This has been putting automatically so you can add some more things in there if you wanted to. The other thing too is so this is the left column over here over the right. We have more options for the image dimensions 768 by 768 is all we get with stable fusion to point one. We can adjust the guidance so we can bring that up a little. If we want it to be a bit more closer to what we want, we can bring it down if we want it to be a little bit more free. And at the moment, I have got one image, I am going to say I want to see four images. And if I want a private session, I can switch to a pro plan. But for now, we have got four images and a few settings for stable fusion. 2.1 let's hit generate and see what we get. 
And now check out these images. We have added that filter. We have got some really high quality images that have really sort of blow, blow me away the detail in the skin. Everything is actually really cool. So what we might do is go up to the close up portrait, change it to old timey and see what we get with that. And we get something a little bit different again. So you can see how we get these cool different sort of options without prompts. The other thing too is if I switch back to establish fusion 1.5 options change again, I can even change. The resolution is something different. Most of the other settings are the same, but I can change the resolution and I'm not sure but it does seem to have more filters. So let's say we go for a perfume filter and we go Merlin, old and wise, powerful wizard. You can check out some of these images. They are pretty cool. We have got a lot of different options there. So that is essentially you have got more filters with, with stable fusion 1.5. So I would highly recommend going and exploring these and having a play because there is definitely a lot of things we can play with here, but we have generated certain images. So let's go down to one of these really cool, really high quality 2.1 images and see what options we have. Again, if I hit the plus symbol, I can edit this so and give it instructions. So it says he added a maybe I will just say close his eyes. So let's generate and see what that does. That actually hasn't closed his eyes at all. But let's take this a step further and see what else we can make happen. Make his moustache blue, give him an cool expression. He's kind of tinted the image a little bit, make it a blue that hasn't done a tone, but it's still, that's something we can play with a little bit further. I would say this image is probably not the best, what I could say even more. Now. We have had some success but the image is a little bit odd, but that's just what happens with a AI. It takes a lot to figure out exactly what works. But you sort of get the idea. You can check out the plans by going up the top here and going to pricing free for everyone. You have got 1000 images a day, images can be used commercially. So straight away you can get started making images. You have got the $15 a month plan. 2000 images a day of confusion. No waiting, no limits faster image generation or you got $10 a month which is 800 doli images. So you can pay up to $25 a month if you want to really get the most out of playground AI. So check out Playground AI the link is in the description. Otherwise, I hope you enjoyed the video. If you like my video please subscribe our channels thanks for watching and see you soon.